Hi guys, for a few minutes before Friday's game, UW and Wazoo will set aside the rivalry and share a moment of unity. Fight, dogs, fight! Beat the Cougs! How does a marching band show gratitude? Well, stay tuned. There'll be a visual and a musical, thanks. So we'll just have to wait and see, huh? That's right, yeah, I don't want to ruin the surprise. We promised UW we wouldn't spoil their show, but Husky Marching Band director Brad McDavid says the Apple Cup audience will see and hear something different during pregame. The staff and I, we've been brainstorming on it for about a year and uh, we think we've got something pretty special planned. A year ago, one of the UW band buses crashed while on their way to Washington State University for the Apple Cup. 39 band members were taken to hospitals and the UW band had to cancel its show. The community of George Washington, where the crash happened, came together to feed and comfort shaken band members. And the Wazoo band played UW's fight song. It's hard to tell on the field, but some members of the band are still healing. A lot of people were really hurt. It took a long time for people to get back. Like I myself, I'm still working on getting physically back. Caitlin Rivera, one of the saxophone section leaders, had a concussion, bruises, and an injured knee. She says Friday's performance will help the band step away from the trauma of the crash. I think it provides us with a sense of closure, you know, to know that we've thanked everybody that um, helped us out after the fact. They'll pay tribute across a hundred yards to rivals turned friends. The Apple Cup is Friday here at Husky Stadium. The band is looking and sounding great. I wish I could say more about what's in that pregame show, but we are sworn to secrecy. If you have tickets to the game, you'll want to be in your seat in time for the pregame show and have your camera ready. Live at UW, Ted Land, King 5 News.